Hi guys, today we're going to go over how to add a cover image to a WordPress page or post. So I'm going to go just below my type page title here, which I have hidden, and I'm going to add a block, and I'm going to add cover, C-O-V-E, there it is, it's under common blocks. I'm going to go to my media library and upload. And you want to make sure that your cover photo is wider than it is tall for it to look right. Now it's going to come in with a darker overlay and it's going to allow you to, you don't have to add a title, but you can. This is my cover title. And then it's going to allow you to choose the overlay color. So if you wanted it for some reason another color, you can. I'm going to stick with black for now. You can turn the opacity up or down. If for this photo, I might turn it down a little so that you can see the writing that I have over it. And you can make this floating or fixed background. I'm going to go ahead and update so we can see what it looks like. And there you go. So this is going to stretch the width of whatever your page width is set to. So if it's not stretching as expected, you need to check your page width. That's really all there is to uh, title uh, the cover. You can change the text orientation, right, left, centered. You can also do the same thing with the photo. If you've got a text block next to it, this is what it would do to cover. I'll just show you what it looks like next to a text block. So there you go. It's just putting it to the right. So if you want for some reason a cover title picture to the left and then have your content to the right, you can do it. And then that's that's about all there is to it. You can transform this block to an image if you don't feel like it anymore into a standard heading. But what this is, is it's combining a heading and image together. Hope that helped. If you liked the video, please smash that like button for me. Subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notifications bell. If you'd like these videos delivered to your inbox as I do them. And as always, don't let your website drive you bananas.